You might be wondering, if the Tesla Semi is truly a game changer, why hasn't Tesla started mass production of it yet? Elon Musk has always been confident that the priority at this point is not to manufacture on a large scale, but to achieve exceptional results and receive positive reviews. Pioneers such as PepsiCo and DHL have already praised the vehicle's smooth integration into their operations and the high level of driver satisfaction. One notable example is the Tesla Semi's fuel consumption. It uses about 1.6 kilowatt hours per kilometer, significantly reducing fuel costs to about $25 per 100 kilometers compared to the approximately $80 that a diesel truck would spend for the same distance. What's more, the vehicle can be fully charged in just 30 minutes, and Tesla expects a production capacity of up to 50,000 units per year. But how exactly has Tesla managed to transform an entire industry with a single model? And how ready is the Tesla Semi for its planned launch in 2025? According to Lars Moravi, Tesla's vice president of vehicle engineering, pilot production is expected to begin in the second half of next year, with mass production expected to begin in the first half of 2026 and gradually reach full capacity throughout the year. The automaker has already revealed that the factory in Reno, Nevada, will be capable of producing up to 50,000 electric trucks per year. Moravi confirmed during the third quarter 2024 earnings call that the schedule is on track. Tesla reported a profit of $2.17 billion on the semi, an impressive 177% year-over-year increase, and total revenue of $25.1 billion, an 8% increase. Currently, all semis are being produced on a small-scale production line at the Nevada Gigafactory. However, Tesla is already building a dedicated semi facility, which is expected to be completed by the end of 2025. Only after this is completed will the company be able to reach its annual target of 50,000 units, as announced by Elon Musk. In the meantime, production at the current location continues at a rapid pace. In early October, 38 new units were built, and a few days later, 50 more trucks were spotted at the facility. In a matter of weeks, the number of semis on site has increased significantly, with around 70 units lined up on both sides of the building. It is estimated that around 250 trucks have already been assembled so far, and that number continues to climb rapidly. If this pace continues, production could reach around 1,000 units as early as next month. The Nevada factory is expected to launch its first commercial version, known as the Semi 0.5, by the end of next year with customer deliveries expected in early 2026. Elon Musk recently responded to a video posted by Tesla Manufacturing's official account showing the semi being tested at Gigafactory Berlin. In his response on the X platform, Musk confirmed that the Tesla semi will be available worldwide, highlighting the potential of this electric truck to not only make roads safer, but also contribute to a cleaner environment thanks to its all-electric nature. And that's just the beginning. The vehicles already on the road have undergone rigorous performance testing and have received significant recognition in the transportation industry. During the North American Council for Freight Efficiencies, NACF, run on less electric program in September, the Tesla Semi covered an impressive 384 miles, 618 kilometers, on a single charge and covered up to 806 miles, 1,297 kilometers, in just 24 hours. NAC CEO Mike Roth praised the semi as the true art of feasibility testing. These results highlight not only the vehicle's potential, but also its durability and reliability. Major names in the logistics industry, such as DHL and PepsiCo, have already shown strong interest in the Tesla semi. DHL, a leading global supply chain company, tested the vehicle on a 3,000 mile, 4,828 kilometers route. And, after two weeks of testing, the results exceeded initial expectations. Over the summer, DHL confirmed that the Tesla Semi is ready to be integrated more broadly into its operations network, highlighting its desire to include these vehicles in its fleet. With orders coming in from big names in the industry, the Semi has cemented its reputation as a true powerhouse in the transportation market. According to Elon Musk, demand for the vehicle is ridiculously high, and he warns that companies that don't adopt electric trucks will be left behind. 
and that's not a matter of opinion. The Tesla Semi has impressive specifications that position it as a serious competitor to traditional diesel trucks. According to Tesla's official website, the vehicle accelerates from 0 to 100 km per hour in just 20 seconds, and in practice, it has exceeded expectations. Real-world tests carried out by companies such as PepsiCo and DHL have shown even more impressive results. When Elon Musk first revealed the speed of the semi, it seemed a bit too ambitious. However, tests have confirmed that the truck can go from 0 to 100 km per hour in just 5 seconds without a load and in less than 20 seconds when fully charged. To put that into perspective, the semi can even be faster than an Alfa Romeo not to mention leaving any diesel truck behind. In addition, the vehicle offers two range options, a 480-kilometer version and another of 800 kilometers, adapting to different transportation needs. And when it comes to charging, the semi impresses again. In just 30 minutes, it can reach up to 70% charge at Tesla stations, ensuring maximum efficiency and virtually eliminating downtime during trips. Although the initial price may seem high, Around $150,000 for the 300-mile model and $180,000 for the 500-mile model. The real difference lies in the long-term savings. The semi consumes just 1.6 kilowatt-hours per mile, reducing energy costs by one-third compared to diesel engines. Over a three-year period, fuel savings can exceed $200,000. Another advantage of the Tesla semi is its reduced maintenance costs. Because it has fewer moving parts than a conventional truck, maintenance costs are much lower. Tesla estimates that maintenance costs will be around 10 cents per mile. For a truck that drives 100,000 miles per year, this would cost approximately $50,000 over five years, a significant reduction compared to the high costs of diesel-powered trucks. The semi proved its worth at the IA Transportation Expo in Hanover where it demonstrated its efficiency and endurance in real-world conditions. According to Dan Priestley, Tesla's truck division leader, the results exceeded initial expectations, with the vehicles achieving an energy efficiency of 1.6 kilowatt-hours per mile, higher than Tesla's initial target of 1.7 kilowatt-hours per mile. One of the most notable highlights is the vehicle's range. The semi can travel up to 1,560 kilometers in a single day, directly competing with diesel trucks in terms of range. With advanced technology, impressive energy efficiency, and a clear long-term economic advantage, the Tesla semi is not only a promise for the future of transportation, it is already proving to be a revolution in motion. The Tesla semi is establishing itself as a compelling alternative to Class 8 heavy-duty trucks. Tesla's fleet of trucks has already covered an impressive 75 million miles in total, with one vehicle in particular reaching the 250,000-mile mark in just 18 months. In terms of reliability, the Semi also stands out, boasting a 95% uptime, a key factor for logistics companies where every minute of downtime can directly impact profitability. In addition, the semi demonstrated solid performance on steep inclines, easily tackling challenges such as the T-Pass at 4,000 feet and the Donner Pass at 740 feet. These results reinforce that the semi is not only a viable alternative, but a true game-changer for the future of transportation. During extensive field tests conducted by DHL, the semi completed routes of up to 390 miles on a single charge, even when fully loaded a remarkable feat for a heavy-duty electric truck. With numbers like these, Semi is among the leaders in the sector, exceeding performance and energy efficiency standards. The enthusiasm of major companies for the Semi reinforces its reliability. Pepsi, one of the first to integrate the vehicle into its California operations, has already noticed the positive impact. Its drivers prefer the Semi to traditional diesel trucks, highlighting the superior comfort and improved performance. The growing acceptance in the market shows that the Semi is no longer seen as a simple technological promise, but as a tool capable of redefining industry standards, delivering operational efficiency and long-term financial benefits. One of the most exciting news for Tesla's electric truck came from the automaker's artificial intelligence team, which revealed advances in the full self-driving FSD system. 
One of the latest models of FSD is being tested in vehicles such as the Model 3 and Cybertruck, with positive reviews from early Cybertruck users who praise the system's reliability in real-world conditions. These advances have generated speculation about when the Semi will receive this technology. In recent discussions, the Tesla team indicated that it plans to constantly update the driver assistance features, as it already does with other vehicles of the brand. The potential integration of FSD into the Semi is generating great excitement among fleet operators who see the technology as an opportunity to revolutionize long-haul transportation, improving safety and reducing operating costs. One clear indication of the technology's development came from a recent video showing a semi-engineering unit equipped with sensors throughout the vehicle, a strong indication that Tesla is making progress in improving FSD for heavy-duty trucks. This test unit, caught on public roads, suggests that Tesla is already refining the technology in real-world situations. This has further fueled excitement in the Tesla community, who believe that the company's advances in artificial intelligence could significantly accelerate the development of a fully functional FSD system. The implementation of this system in the semi promises to radically transform the freight transportation industry offering a safer and more cost-effective electric alternative to traditional Class A trucks. Tesla Semi is already on the road, but a new hint at the future of this technology has recently emerged, thanks to an intriguing tease from Tesla's AI team. This teaser came at the perfect time, reigniting the excitement surrounding the truck's FSD, full self-driving experience. After the Cybertruck's update, Social media quickly filled with questions about when the Semi would receive this innovation. Tesla's response was subtle but full of anticipation. This isn't the end of the series, just the end of the season, hinting at a possible big announcement before the official reveal of the FSD display for the Semi. Tesla is investing heavily in the future of autonomous driving, with more than $1 billion invested in research and development through 2023. The company is also paving the way for innovation in road safety and operational efficiency. The Semi is equipped with an advanced suite of sensors, including next-generation radar and cameras that provide 360-degree vision for up to 250 meters, allowing it to detect obstacles at a distance equivalent to two football fields. In addition, Tesla is making FSD more affordable. The initial cost, which was $15,000, will drop to $10,000 by 2025. This reduction aims to democratize access to autonomous technology, making it a viable option for small transportation companies and not just a high-cost luxury. FSD also promises to bring huge financial and operational benefits. In models such as the Model 3, Model Y, and Cybertruck, version 12 of FSD has already been released and the Semi will now be able to operate for longer periods without the need for human intervention. This is significant, considering that approximately 94% of road accidents are caused by human error. With FSD, the risk per mile traveled can be drastically reduced. In addition to improving safety, this technology can generate savings of up to 20% in operational costs by avoiding unnecessary stops, optimizing routes, and maximizing operational efficiency. On the charging front, Tesla is expanding its supercharger network, which now exceeds 45,000 stations worldwide, with about 25% of those in the United States. The company is also developing a 1,800-mile corridor connecting Texas and California, equipped with powerful 750 kilowatts chargers designed to recharge 70% of the battery in just 30 minutes about the right amount of time for a quick coffee. With this infrastructure, trucks will be able to crisscross the United States from coast to coast, eliminating range anxiety. In addition, Tesla's mega charger technology allows for up to 400 miles of range to be recharged in half an hour, minimizing downtime and increasing productivity for self-employed drivers and trucking companies. In terms of cost-effectiveness, the cost per mile to recharge an electric semi is around $0.07, cents, compared to $0.12 to $0.15 cents for diesel options. This difference not only benefits companies' profits, but also contributes to a more sustainable future. 
Tesla also prioritizes safety in its charging infrastructure. Supercharger stations are regulated to prevent overloads and ensure protection during charging. This commitment has been reflected in a 95% satisfaction rate among drivers. Now, the big question, would you feel safe sharing the road with a fully autonomous truck? Do you believe that FSD will become the new standard in long-haul transportation? If you like the content, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel to stay up to date with more news.